This Tyler we're checking in the Houston team number 4610 Bear Tax coming out of Texas. I'm here with Angel and Nathan. We're going to check out more about the robot here on Behind the Bumper. So uh, we have a, some cool things to talk about, a level two climb, uh, a crossbow on the robot, uh, some cool elevators and intake. So I want to start out with the crossbow here. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit about uh, what's going on, how does it work, that sort of thing. Yeah, so basically the main features of the crossbow is that it self-centers. So it's got the surgical tubing here that pulls it left and right based on when we actuate it. So if you'll hold that crossbow up at an angle like that, and then uh, if you can intake. Okay. So you can see it can pull in it at many angles, and then say we stick one side of this and we outtake it, it can place at angles as well. And so that's the main features of that. Uh, what about the uh, intake here? So you guys have the mechanic wheels on the front uh, with the cargo. Can we show that off a little bit as well? Yeah, so if he's, he'll lift up the four bar for us a little bit. And then basically what'll happen is when we intake, this pneumatic cylinder is gonna extend out intake. It's gonna extend out and it's gonna allow it anywhere it hits. As soon as it touches that, it's gonna suck right, in. Well, let's do the test here. And hit those. Right, and so we actually have, if we pull that out, we have holding current on yeah. there just so it holds in nice and firm. Very cool. And Angel, I want to hear uh, more about this uh, four bar mechanism that you're using and uh, any other components you may want to talk about here on the robot. All right, so uh, we, we decided to go with a four bar this year because uh, one thing that we did last year for Power Up was an elevator. And we decided, you know what, it would be easy enough to go revert back to an elevator, but why not do a four bar? Why not try something new? And that's where the four bar came in. And it helps keep this, uh, keeps the intake system parallel when we're scoring, such as on the, uh, when we're up there trying to score uh, level three hatch panels on the rocket or level two cargo on the rocket. Um, another thing that we have is our level two climb mechanism that we, um, we implemented during uh, the state championship. And pretty much what it has is it's got two uh, pneumatic cylinders here that will lift it up uh, enough just to get these omni wheels in the front over the uh, hab level two, they'll extend. And then once we're on top of that, we'll retract these back up and then extend this uh, pneumatic, pneumatic bar with some omni wheels on the bottom to get us leveled and then just drive on and retract that back up. 4610, thanks for taking the time to talk more about your robot. Can't wait to see how you guys do here at Houston. A fantastic team's coming here at the Houston Championship, and we can't wait to keep showing you more and more robots here on Behind the Bumpers. We need your help to keep fun loud, live, and independent. Help us by visiting our Patreon to pledge your support at patreon.com forward slash first updates now. You can also support fun live on Twitch for a few bucks a month or by linking your Prime account for free and clicking subscribe. Thank you to all of our co-executive producers keeping fun loud, live, and independent.